It's a nice feeding in match play when you can play an attacking iron shot right up against the flag, especially if you can get in before your opponent because it puts the pressure onto them. I'm going to go through my preference how I like to do that. I actually like to take one less club than normal. So in this situation, it's 155 yards, normally a seven iron for me. I'm going to take an eight iron. Now the reason I do that is it helps to make sure I commit to the shot and really attack it in a positive way. Not thrash at it, I still want rhythm, but I want to make sure I'm fully committed. Now even in a situation like this where there's a bit of water in front of the flag, I'm still going to do that. Taking more club, I often find for myself and other golfers, makes them too careful and too easy on the swing. As a result, they lose the control. That's not going to be the way you're going to attack that flag. So slightly less club is my first recommendation. Then you're going to make a couple of changes and a feeling. The change you're going to make is you're going to put the ball slightly further back in your stance, slightly towards my right foot for me. That's actually going to take a little bit of loft off the club and give me a little bit more strength at the impact. The second thing, the feeling I'm after, is when I'm hitting the shot, it's almost as if I'm going to throw the ball and really extend it towards the target. That makes sure the energy of the club and the energy of my arms is always extending down the target line. That's going to give me a lot of accuracy along with that power. Too much club in your hand, you won't be able to do that without blasting it over the green, so you tend to then quit on it a little bit, and once again, you lose the control. So if you're after that attacking shot, next to the flag, slightly less club. I'm going to put it all into action for you now. I've got my club ready, I'm going to feel that ball position just going back very slightly, and then that real extension to the target. As a result, straight down that target line, got my partner worried. In summary, for the attacking shot, take one less club than normal. That will help you be positive. Point two, place the ball slightly further back in the stance than you would normally have it. That will allow you to take some loft off and get a powerful blow. Third point, make sure you really extend the club head and the arm down the target line. You must feel the energy going straight to the hole.